Hello everyone, my name is Rahul and welcome to my channel Rahul QA Labs. So today we will look about what is Mantis BT and what are the important features of Mantis BT. Okay, so Mantis BT uh, stands for Mantis Bug Tracker. So as the name suggests, uh, it is a bug tracking tool and uh, it is a web-based open source tool and it is built on the PHP platform. So basically it is used to track bugs and the issues in a software project. Mantis BT is available on various platforms like desktop UI, mobile UI and as an API. So in the mobile, uh, as you all can read out here, Mantis supports iPhone, Android and Windows platforms. So uh, it's an open source tool, web based bug tracking tool. Uh, it is used since 2000 and uh, it is available on different platforms. Platforms, if I talk about, so uh, it can be Unix, Linux, Mac OS, Windows, and uh, it supports uh, different browser like Chrome, Firefox, Safari. So uh, let's move forward and see uh, some of the good features of Mantis BT. Okay, so these are the features of uh, Mantis Bug Tracker. So let's read out the first one. A good email system to send notifications to different users. Now this tool has a very good email notification system in order to tell its users what are the updates happening on the bug. Uh, are there any uh, new bugs that are created or assigned to them to the respective users. So it has a very good email notification system. Now, next one is web UI. So it is very, very simple to handle. Like it is very, very user friendly. Uh, next one is uh, it can control uh, user access at a project level. So you can create uh, different users and you can assign them the access as per the project. Coming to next one, we have the addition of custom fields at project level. So at each of the project, you can define some fields for, uh, you know, pertaining to that particular project and that fields can be assigned to that project so that it makes it easier to identify the project and you can search with the help of those fields as well. Next one is uh, dashboard. So dashboard is very simple and user friendly and uh, as I said, it uh, supports different operating systems, uh, Mac OS, Windows, Linux, etc. Uh, it has support for different browsers as well, uh, like Firefox, Safari, Opera, Internet Explorer, etc. And it supports different databases. So databases like MySQL, MS SQL, PostGRE SQL. So it has support for different databases. Uh, you can integrate Mantis BT uh, with different other tools uh, with the help of APIs, uh, say for example, TestLink. And this has a very good chat feature as well. Up and last apart from that is the report generation and matrices. So uh, you can generate a different kind of reports pertaining to your uh, project requirement and uh, you know, the instructions given by the project leader. And you can analyze uh, how many defects are raised, how many issues are still pending, how many issues are resolved, how many issues are still assigned uh, to the particular developer or the tester or still they are in pending status. So uh, we'll see uh, more of the Mantis BT in detail in our next uh, tutorial. So just to show you all a small uh, like UI for the Mantis. So let's go to the UI part. Okay, so as you all can see that uh, this is uh, the home page of uh, Mantis Bug Tracker where you need to provide your login and uh, let's log in and have a short look on it. Provide the password. And login. So as I told you all like it's a very user friendly and uh, all the left hand panel and the top panel 
all these issues that are categorized into different categories so it is very easy and it's very uh, you know classifiable like you can view the issues you can report change logs so all these things will deal in detail in our uh, next tutorial uh, so i hope uh, you all uh, must have got some idea on what is mantis bt and what are its uh, important features thank you very much for watching the video and if you like the video please uh, share and uh, subscribe my channel and keep learning thank you very much bye bye